Lurigancho Jail is one of South America's toughest prisons. Conditions are appalling due largely to overcrowding. Built for 3,600, it now houses nearly 10,000 inmates. In Peru, officially, uh, we assume that the criminals had a second chance and they have to be uh, rehabilitated. But unfortunately, uh, the reality uh, is not normally like that because we don't have enough phones, we don't have enough money and budget. With mass overcrowding, Luri Gancho's 21 overcrowded cell blocks can explode into open civil war. In 1986, in one day alone, 124 prisoners died. The authorities only have 100 guards to police 10,000 violent inmates. It has led to an extraordinary deal. The Peruvian prison service has handed power to the inmates. It is very difficult for 100 people to control 10,000 inmates. Smell it in the air. A lot of people wonder if you still care. And know you still there. Cause I lost it all. I keep calling your name, but do you hear my call? And know you still involved. Or am I left alone? I wander the street, cause I no longer have a home. My brother's all gone, my sister's all gone. My family and my friends ain't gonna be here in the morning. And you see me here moan, and they say you feel my pain. They say you went through it, say the die is the game. But I ain't gained nothing, I lost everything. Everybody. Now I'm losing my mind and my faith is all I got in I'm still holding on, that's why I still pray Feeling empty inside, I can't make it through the day I don't know what else to do, I don't know what else to say I'm talking to you now, but I promise that you feel so far
los internos. We're going to enter the place where our mission will be done. We will work with where we work with the interns. Este era el peor pabellón de todo el penal. It was the worst pavilion in the whole uh, jail Ahora es considerado uno de los mejores pabellones, limpio. Now it's considered one of the best pavilions, clean, painted, safe. La gente ha cambiado bastante. People have changed a lot. Gracias a la misericordia de Dios. Thank you to God's uh, work.